Exposing Garrosh Shadow Scale, and um, I was I'm a former member of that server. Amogus. <laughs> and this is the thing. Nani? Omae wa mou shinde iru. I have never seen such a. Yeah, he edited this recently, a few months ago. This wasn't like that. Do not. It used to have. Uh, the first part was not even there. The rest of it was, and pretty much the rest of it has remained unchanged. It's just rule number one. Back in September of this time of year last year. The difference between these rules back then and now were, you know, um, rule number one, no active streamers or YouTubers allowed here. That part wasn't there until only a couple months ago. Self-centered Discord server. This server has to be one of the most selfish, cult-like Discord servers I have ever seen. Hello everyone, Dander here, and welcome back. So this will be another rant video and we are going to be taking a look at Garo Shadow Scale. Before I get into the video, my last video I made of him, I never talked at all. So that's why I'm going to be making this video. Ever since I released the last video, Garo made sure I don't come back into his server by making it so you have to have a phone number to get in. That just makes my last video and this video valid. Also, be sure to like and subscribe with notifications turned on. Anyway, let's get right into the video. So in case if you all don't know who Garo Shadowscale is, he is a YouTuber with around 30,000 subscribers and he does live streams of random games. His videos seem very fun to watch and appears to be a normal YouTuber. But this YouTuber has to be one of the most selfish, most narcissistic YouTubers I have ever met. I have known Garo for a few months now. I used to be in his Discord server, but I didn't pay attention to the rules. I have talked to Garo and asked him if he had a YouTube channel. After that I mentioned that I was a YouTuber, he then said that YouTubers are not allowed in his server, and he blocked me and banned me with no questions asked. I have always wondered why would he not allow YouTubers to go into his server, so I decided to go undercover as an alt and see what was up. After I joined and carefully read the rules, I was in shock. What kind of server is this? No YouTubers, Twitch streamers allowed in the server, no That wasn't like that before. No, he didn't even say anything about no Twitch streamers back then. So, he's really becoming Sending friend selfish. requests to any other members of the server. No arrogance, selfishness, toxicity, drama, and etc. This rule makes Garo a hypocrite. And with rule number five, I overlooked. It says at the beginning, no NSFW and stuff like that, which seems normal for a Discord server until you read a little farther. Then you will notice no OC, Sona artwork, and discussion unless if it has or talks about Garo. Yeah, that part is, has been there, I don't know, for how long. That's been unchanged. That rule yeah. alone just makes Garo look real selfish, don't you think? Shit. And the last one, rule number seven. It's just the rule where you have to DM Garo to see if anyone's breaking the rules in the server. All these rules are just quite bizarre, and these rules just make the server not worth hanging out in. So as I was in his server, I noticed everyone was giving him excessive love and affection, like they had a gun to their head to do so, which kind of looks like North Korea. Yeah. Corporate needs you to find the differences between this picture and this picture. They're the same picture. All the memes in his server are just memes about Garo, and the art section is just about Garo's character. Like for example, learn Pokemon Unite by other YouTubers as the X button, and then learn Pokemon Unite by Garo. This was either made by one of Garo's mods or Garo himself. There is a lot more memes like this in his Discord server, and it is on his Reddit. So wait, why are you making another video? Well, turns out, I am not the only one who has noticed these things with Garo. In the past, Several other people have had issues with Garo. <laughs> yeah, issues with them. That is me right there. 
I made fun of him saying he was gay in, uh, although, uh, just, you know, not to be offensive, but he says, I'm not gay. <laughs> He's like, no, 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 yeah. But this was on June, in June, when I actually posted a video, and, um, yeah, that video, when I posted, was meant for the devs of that one game to look at, you know, for bug fixes, and apparently, I guess, one of his so-called, uh, servants were, I guess, looking at everyone's, uh, I don't know, I guess, uh, accounts or whatever, where they have Facebook, you know, uh, connections, I guess, on, uh, yeah. Yeah. Garo and Garo has lost a lot of people in his server over the years due to his desperate need of admiration. So after I made the last video about Garo, a former member, friend of Garo, decided to contact me and give me more info about him. I will not say any names of who this user is for the sake of his safety. Really? Didn't teach him over time how to behave and drag to her focus. But after many nights of effort, I don't make full credit. <laughs> but it took hard time to drive him and train him into that direction, really. He never told me any of this, and this is all news to me. Yeah. And, uh, Thanderwolf told me that, uh, he, uh, that most of his subscribers were bots, and I kind of agreed, because back in last year, he was only at 450 subs, which is about the same amount of subs as that I have, so. I don't know. Maybe they're all sub-botting or something, which is actually a bannable thing on YouTube. Um, it can get you banned, actually. Based on the screenshots, he is very narcissistic. Like I think when he just one of the mods, or like I guess one of to the be uh, other former ones. I don't know. Friends with one of Garo's moderators. Garo wasn't happy about that and flipped, claiming that he doesn't trust anyone being friends with his community members or so. Like that's gonna draw attention away from Garo. Like what? My Discord server. I allow YouTubers. I allow people. I allow anyone. I allow people to make friends with each other. It's okay to send friend requests to other server members in my server and probably other servers as well. That's literally the whole point of Discord, but to Garo, nope, it's not okay. Not okay at all. No friend requests, no talking about other YouTubers, nothing. You can only talk about him. And as an alt, I bruh, said, bruh. have y'all heard of Dander Wolf? And guess what? I got banned. And there can only be one explanation to why he doesn't want YouTubers in his server. That's right. He is afraid of getting exposed. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'm also glad I wasn't the only one who saw that this was off about Garo himself. Wait. Apparently, I was the first one to ever make a video about Garo, and I've gotten a lot of DMs from people that are glad that I did make one. So anyway, be sure to click that like and subscribe button, and I hope you all have a I good day, and I'll see you all later. Bye! <laughs> I hope others have, you know, um, done that too, making videos exposing him. Yeah. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. And stay away from Garo. Um, he doesn't like many others. Although he gave me two chances. He knows I have problems, but two chances that doesn't I don't think he gave people that many chances but that's it thank you guys so much for watching see you later yeah.